Welcome back, Nick and Lex here. Thank you so much for joining me today to this new episode of Music with Nick. I'm super excited for another marathon today that we got from Roundabout. Thank you so much, Roundabout, for sponsoring this. I'm really stoked about this. Um, so we have a list here, and uh, there's not a lot of intro uh, in uh, instructions by um, by Roundabout. It's just you know um um the years and stuff like that super super um uh i mean there's not a lot of info so um let's go through the uh the songs that we're gonna um, react to today we're gonna start off with rare earth and um i looked it up here rare earth this song is called hey big brother is from 1971 from uh, first not released but it's uh in fill your head on spotify but this is usually um on the rare earth and concert that was which was like a live version but um yeah so we're gonna do that first then blue image never heard of that band uh love is the answer from the album open this is from 1970 we're gonna do two songs from this album then the band help exclamation mark for sale album help and this is here um he told me this is from 1970 um 1971 actually on the cover on the album cover then we're gonna do more um oh wait a minute we're gonna do a uh, crabby appleton piece by piece from the Krabby Ableton album, 1970. And then the cool thing is I have no idea what this is. Prague, just rock. or And then we're going to do more Blue Image. Take Me from, again, the album open, 1970. So, yeah, I have no idea what I'm getting into here. Like, super stoked for this. Super excited. And um, thank you. Thank you so much, Roundabout, for, for sponsoring this, this marathon. And um, let's get into it. So give me one moment. I'll be right back. All righty then. Uh, and here we go with the first song, Hey Big Brother.
Hey, big brother. I know you're out there somewhere. If we don't get our thing together, big brother will be watching us. He ain't gonna get me. Are you gonna let him get you? He'll never get me. He'll never get me, no. guys are on fire i i know them from the i just want to celebrate another day of living and that literally was an accident when i because i was watching this movie i really recommend this film um it's with uh george clooney and mark Wahlberg, and it's i know you're gonna say oh god mark although mark Wahlberg is a very good actor if you ask me and George Clooney, and I think some other guy who directed the film also plays the lead role. Three Kings, and and it's in, it's basically the aftermath of the Gulf War when they're just like hanging around there, and they're basically, the war is over, but they're still there, and it's just like there's nothing really to do. I haven't watched a movie in a while, but um, uh, and and they they sing I just wanna celebrate, and I was like, what the, what is this song? So I found out um that it was Rare Rare Earth, and it's also the most famous song on on Spotify. So man, what a great rhythm section, you know? And then dun 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 dun, dun, dun. and I love they all they always sing in chorus. Hey, big brother, you know, always in harmony, really, really cool band, really great track, uh, track. Um, just like a feel good, you know, rock. This is really, really good. Thank you so much, um, Roundabout for this. So now we're going to listen to Blue Image. We got two songs by Blue Image, so I'm sure they mean something um, to roundabout we're gonna do a shorter song and the last song is seven minutes and 35 seconds and this was amazing because literally <laughs> roundabout hit the mark this is the first marathon that is 25 minutes exactly down to the second which is pretty difficult to do you know i mean you know you put them together and then maybe it's a little bit over which i don't mind but this is exactly 25 minutes so Thank you so much. Okay, love is the answer. Blue image. Let's go.
Wow, they can really shred these guys. I can only imagine. I mean, this was the, the short one. We're going to listen to a seven minute of these guys. I love these bands that are like, you know, they are playing their stuff, but there's you can also feel some sort of a jam going on. Like they're in the zone and they're bringing it to you. So this is what I feel, especially Rare Earth, also Blue Image. It's just like they get into a vamp and then they just go for it, you know, and they just let's just keep going, keep going with the. You know, with the chorus and uh, man, freaking very, very good. Now, help um, is the next one with their with the title track help. No idea. Maybe same directions, but I love this early 70s stuff. Um, and it is different than the prog stuff. It is different than Zeppelin. It is more like I love when 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 70s. This reminds me more of like Blood, Sweat and Tears. And, um, I don't know, like th those kind of bands, you know? So, um, oh, Marty, what's going on here? Huh? Yeah. Today, you're not going to be in the picture because you distract people. You, he is very distracting. He's just too cute. You can't focus. I can't focus, but I don't know what he wants. I just took him for a walk and now he's, I guess he misses his mama. You miss your mama? Yeah, you do. What? Oh, okay. All right. Okay. So here we go for sale by help. is so good in this if you would listen to me like without the music it's hilarious like i sometimes listen because it's two devices recording one is re recording my voice and one is recording the music and it puts it together and i sometimes watch the videos where i just i can i can't hear the music i can just listen to myself and i'm like <laughs> like I'm like singing and humming stuff that doesn't exist. I mean, yes, it, it's being played, but I think it's going to go a certain direction and, and it doesn't. But this is so good. I love the acoustic guitar. I love the singing. The bass is amazing. Everything is great. And um, some air bass, air bass uh, in the house. All right, let's, let's continue. <laughs>
Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful solo there in the like the Arabian like an Arabian scale or Phrygian mode. Like a lot of people, you know, um, when you get a little bit more technical, these are more the um, Greek, you know, uh, modes, the terms. Um, really cool, man. Uh, Santana plays in this key a lot. Um, maybe not. I think he's more into like the Ionian, Locrian, uh, something like that. I, I, I have to look it up. But um, this is uh, absolute gold this whole like marathon so far is amazing all right i'm back i did want to look this up real quick because there's a lot of you santana lovers and i have not covered enough santana i i know the greatest hits you know i know samba pati europa um black magic woman um like all like i think there's like 30 best of hits but afar from that i don't know a lot of santana i do know i must say maybe 20 30 songs and i even used to play santana um so no he uses the dorian mode he's famous for using that mode um when he improvises and um it's a hell of a mode to use i i love it myself um so yeah just wanted to get that out there for people who's like what the phrygian mode santana what the hell is this guy on i'm sorry i didn't mean to um but yeah so okay this was great this was a great band help for sale check it out i think i'm too loud let's go back a little bit let's dial it back a little bit okay now this is uh piece by piece from crabby Krabby, Krabby Appleton band. And um, they're a smaller band by the looks of it. Only one album here. No, two. One in 1970 and one in 2005. I guess maybe this is a... I don't know if they returned on its Warner Brothers. Yes. That's like the saving, uh, the saving song of the marathon if it gets blocked. Okay. Piece by piece. Here we go. No 
wow, these guys are on fire. Like if I some I said smaller band, how can these guys be guys be how can these guys be small? Can't even talk. This is so good. All these what all these bands have in common is that they all have an amazing uh rhythm section, like you know, bongos and congas and all this stuff. I love that stuff. It sounds a little bit like the doors here, you know, the keyboard and um uh man like the organ the organ um i'm gonna look up some stuff here while we play this this is freaking gold to this band i'm looking up there's only one album but it doesn't really say what happened and okay the band's second album rotten to the core was recorded in 1971 but sales were disappointing and the band split up damn um they shouldn't have they should have powered through and made a third record you know but i but this is in the 70s i guess i don't know today Obviously, if you fail on your first album, you're done. But usually people just keep, you know, can. This is a good band. This was like literally. Whew, other level. Love that, that. That solo, that keyboard solo. Whew, good stuff, man. All right. So let's move it on. I'm getting like, I'm sweating here, literally. Like, because I'm like, oh, it's so good. Um, okay, back to Blue Image and I Blue's Image. I really love their first song, uh, Love is the Answer. Let's go with Take Me. This is almost an eight minute track. Let's go. Some electrolytes. <laughs> Thank you. 
Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Jam.
No, these guys, very ballsy. I love the sound. Great improvisation, great riffs, bass, just like beautiful. I love this. I don't even know what I'm going to call this, um, but I'm loving it. And um, I got another song. I want to add something for myself, um, but I'm going to go the correct route. I'm not going to deviate. What do all these bands have in common? James Gang. I'm going to play James Gang. Funk 49. And I know I just looked it up. Uh, this is with um, the amazing uh, Joe Walsh, Jim Fox, and this and Dale Peters. This was written in 69, released in 1970. Here we go. I, I literally like this is a great song. Do 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 dum dum. I love the all palm mute. They give it more punch. What a great song for 1969, man! Holy moly, I'm loving this. And I mean, Joe Walsh's his vocals are just so good. I'm loving this. Funk 49, man. I I I don't remember doing this. I mean, I just. If I've done it before, it sounds very, very freaking new. And um, I don't know. Let's just let's let's keep going. my song i can interrupt it i'm just kidding so uh roundabout just wrote to me and it says hey nick uh just wanted to let you know that joe macri left a comment five days on your crack the sky marathon from a year ago oh he played on all four songs you reacted to and on the one track by them from your much more recent marathon holy holy um he's a hell of a bass player uh, here's the link to an interview. Thank you so much, Roundabout, for that. I'm going to check that out. Um, I also got a message, I think, from a fan club, the Crack, Crack the Sky. I still have to get back to them um, because they wanted to send me a shirt. That's awesome. So, yeah, let's we'll do that, definitely. Oh, my God. That is so cool. That's such an honor when these amazing musicians 
reach out to us, you know, just for listening to their music. That's just so humbling because, I mean, they wrote this stuff. They wrote these masterpieces. So, yeah, beautiful, beautiful stuff. I know what you're doing if you're gonna act that way. I think there's trouble brewing. Awesome. Freaking awesome. I think this was a great track to end the marathon. Ah. <laughs> I guess that was their into the next song. This was awesome. Thank you so, so much, Roundabout. I'm super glad we did this last song and, um, Thank you so, so much for the good news that people are writing to us. Thanks, everyone, for watching, for being here, for liking the channel. We love you guys. All your support, your comments, your feedback is always appreciated. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful weekend, and I'll see you guys in the next video.